Most of the major religions believe that Almighty God became a human being once. Some believe he became a human being many times. And when you ask these people, they have a very good logic. That Almighty God, he's so pure, he's so holy, he does not know the shortcomings of the human beings. He does not know the difficulties of the human being. And he came in this world to know what is good or what is bad for the human being. So that he could set the rules for the human being. But I tell these people, that suppose I manufacture a tape recorder. I create a tape recorder. Do I have to become a tape recorder to know what is good or what is bad for the tape recorder? I write an instruction manual that if you want to play the audio cassette, insert the audio cassette and press the play button. If you want to fast forward, press the FF button. Similarly, when Almighty God, He is the creator of the human beings, He does not have to become a human being to know what is good or what is bad for the human being. What does He do? He reveals the instruction manual. The glorious Quran is the last and final instruction manual revealed by Almighty God to the human beings. The do's and don'ts of the human being is mentioned in the Quran.